Yardy? 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 You already know. What's good with the gangsters? Today we got the one and only fuck. Oh, that's the wrong way. One and only glasses up keys, my boy. What's good? I'm looking so fly. He's looking so fly today, guys. Give him compliments. Should I crank my gain for the one time? No, yes, I won't. <laughs> no, no, don't do it. <laughs> no, that's for, for my sake, don't do it. I would yeah, say yeah. do it to the stream, but not for me. RIP headphone users. <laughs> Which is probably most people here. Uh, yeah. Sour and Tricky, thank you guys for the resubs. I appreciate you. Welcome in. Drop your new shit. I've been blessed, bro. How you been? How you been, homie? How do I submit my music, bro? Uh, do explanation marks submit in chat, read the prompt, and then follow that. Two ways to submit. There is a free way with channel points, and then the other like standard submissions are for subs. Uh, but you can watch the whole like explanation video. It's like 45 seconds. Jug! What's goody, bro? It's been a hot minute. Hope you're a blast. Ayo! What's goody, fam? Welcome in. How do, what do I call you? Polly? Uh, you can call me Fatty. Chubby. Chubby Chaser, Homer Simplord, you know, the typical stuff. Me and my bro just dropped that banger. Let's fucking go, Addle Tuners. You already know. ATL in the building. <laughs> I was going to say Addle Tuners. <laughs> I've never heard Atlanta called Addle. Addle Tuners, no. <laughs> oh my god, I didn't even realize it was ATL for Atlanta, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was just some fucking gang shit, bro. How am I supposed to know? I don't, I'm not a United States, man. I'm not a United States kind of guy, okay? Respectfully. Facts. I've never been there. Don't know if I will go there. Don't plan on it anytime soon. <laughs> I'm going to chill where I'm at. All right. Okay. Uh, all right. Antone dropped something yesterday when I was going to stream, so I'm gonna play that regardless, cause homie to go. And then we got G I, like I know who that is. Yeah, he's been coming to my stream since YouTube, bro. He's fucking. Oh, he's okay. a producer, but he's finally started like putting vocals on shit. We actually Word. got a, a track together. I'll show you uh, either on stream or just after. Is it out? No, not yet. Not yet. I'm stockpiling oh, okay. some shit. All right, let's play some What's Antone. I've never been to the U.S. either, bro. Yeah. You know what's crazy? We both... Well, I don't know about you, how far your drive is to the U.S., but mine's only like two hours, and I've never been. Weird. Yeah, it's like... Uh, I think you can take a ferry from the island to uh, Washington, but either way, unless I'm going somewhere like specifically, I'm not trying to just go across. Like, ooh, cool. Part of the Seattle's in Washington, right? Okay. And when you said Washington, I was like, I know there's two Washingtons. I just, I'm probably going to sound really stupid, but. Yeah, Washington, there's like Washington <laughs> State and then there's Washington. DC. DC, yeah. So it's just the city, right? I don't know. Anyway. I don't know. It's like a district or something. I don't even fucking know. Yeah, I'm, I don't know how it works, bro. I don't know U.S. <laughs> geography. Y'all been outside of Canada for both of y'all? I've been to Mexico. Once. yeah same i've been to mexico for vacation yeah all inclusive i've never been to europe or anything though nope that's it have you been to canada though bro no you haven't don't even say yes it just oh, no. John, you don't need to flex on us like that it just Hey, too much, too much, yeah. too much. What you talking about? Yeah, yeah, too yeah. much, too much, too much. What you talking about? Hey. Too much, too much, too. What you talking about? Too much, too much, too, too, too much in the back. I gotta go to the coast. Baby, don't run out of luck. Huh? Now I'ma go like a ghost. Huh? Money gon' swing like a Michael. Running around like a psycho. They better call me a king. Huh? Like I'm a newest disciple. Huh? Like I'm a crazy killer. Came out from the villa. Gotta get the paper like a Mega Miller. I ain't with the game. We ain't take those pictures. All the women crazy. They ain't big. They dip another murder. How just got me on? Big attack the way I'm hitting the song. I ain't tripping. We don't wear no V-Long. Rappers Cody coming straight from the bone. Yes. Rap like this. Gotta take my chances. I don't wanna get too wrong. Hey, Love like this. Gotta take my chances. I don't wanna fall too hard. Hey, Rap like this. Just gotta take my chances, I don't wanna get too wrong Hey, flow like this, gotta take my chances, I don't wanna fight too hard Too much, too much, too much, what you talking about? Too much, too much, too much, what you talking about? Too much, too much, too much, what you talking about? Too much, 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 what you talking about? Too much, too much, too much, what you talking about? Too much 
Yeah, I fuck with this a lot. I'm sure he's not even gonna watch this VOD later. Maybe he'll resend this or come in, but dude, I fuck with this shit so hard. I like the uh he the thing about like old school type tracks is like a lot of the time they feel sort of corny or like the vocals feel under processed. Everything here feels like a modern production with like old school influence. And I really fuck with that a lot. And I think it's super clean. Um, but yeah, how are you feeling about it, bro? Dude, I want to know what Mikey uses. That fucking high end sounds so nice. Yeah, man. So he fucking really clean. dialed that in. It's like, you know, when you're moving a, a slider up in a plugin and it's like, eh, too much, eh, too little, but you yeah. can't find the sweet spot and then you try another plugin. <laughs> That's what it yeah. sounds like he did. <laughs> Oh like, god. <laughs> it really dialed it in. <laughs> Bro, dial that shit in nice. <clears throat> um so yeah, if you do explanation marks submit in chat, it'll give you a response. There's like a 45 second explanation video if you don't understand what's being written as well. It's very simple like standard submissions are for subscribers to the channel and then you can also do free ones uh through two, with 2000 channel points which you earn by just chilling in chat. Um Holy you know messaging shit like that. What? I'm gonna send in every song in my discography. I was about to with say, Channel Points. Probably been fucking racking the <laughs> up for a long time, dog. <laughs> <laughs> um. Also, if you guys, you know, can't figure it out or don't want to do any of that either, like if we get through the whole like standard submission pay queue, then I might just open it up to whoever's in chat and just like take them that way. Like you just drop links when I like say so so if you want to stick around for that feel free anyway and that's for this stream only yeah yeah, yeah. maybe i don't know it's not my stream i can't yeah, control depends that. on how long we go how many people come through but uh i always get the subs first because you know they're subscribers you feel me All right. 
Um, obviously, I don't understand a lick of what you said, so I can't critique what you're saying, which might be strategic. Um, but anyway, uh, that's that's it. It's just please give me your love over your real love over and over. Well, okay then. I I don't know what it would sound like in, like in English. You know what I mean? It sounds sonically like pretty solid. Like you're getting much better at like sounding more fluent with your auto tune and everything. Like things sound cleaner. Um, Doesn't it sound yeah. like there's a weird flanger on it or something? Not to me, no. I don't think so. I don't think so. It sounds like it's just over layered. Like there's a lot of high end in here. And I feel like you've also kind of slammed the master a lot. Like th things don't feel super dynamic. Like there's not a, uh, much space at all, which could be a part of the production, like the beat that you found on YouTube or whatever. But um, compressor yeah. needle. Yeah, for real. Just like, <laughs> you know there's I mean? there's none of this happening on the no. needle. It's just. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Man. <laughs> Fuck, man. Am I on Discord checking submissions? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, like, uh, when you're a sub to the channel, not, like, following and subs are different on Twitch. I don't know how new you are to Twitch. But um, if you're a sub to the channel and you connect your Twitch to your Discord account, uh, it unlocks the sub-only channels specifically. Um, it's meant to be for, like, the tight-knit community of people that want to come submit every week when I go live. Uh, and it's more fair that way because I used to do skip the lines and free submissions. And then uh, a lot of people wouldn't get paid for frees when they would sit here for hours. So, um, I changed it, but anyway, uh, there is a free one still that can put you into the queue. If you just use the channel points, uh, otherwise, um, no, if you're wondering how to get channel other. points, yeah, you just fucking chill. You just chill and watch. You know, do it. Do what we're doing. <laughs> fuck with this a lot bro this feels like very cinematic like a moment in a game or like some sort of movie scene yeah this is hard How bro long was that? uh oh, that sure, was, it? yeah it was only two minutes yeah it felt like it needed to keep going but i mean like i wouldn't probably listen to the whole thing if it like repeated but um yeah no, but if it switched up for another like 30 seconds minute i wouldn't be mad at that that's true yeah it's super fucking vibey bro it's really clean um but yeah, what do you think about it, bro? I was. Did you see me jump? No, I didn't see that. Sorry. I jumped out of my chair and danced like an idiot. <laughs> Fuck! I was going to my settings because somebody mentioned something about the mic. Yeah, I forgot. Oh. So studio rack reset, and I don't have my fucking filters on. I gotta reset them later. Um, but yeah. God damn it, studio I'll rack. That. I was. I recorded a couple of videos. I was like, why does my audio feel quieter? But it makes sense. It's not even processed anymore. 
Oh, I'm. I gotta ask you about uh, OBS after. Hydrate. I, I tried to record today. like three videos, and all of the, um, so my camera looks fine in OBS, but yeah. afterwards it's so choppy, and all my settings are the same as before. So I have no idea if it's, like I gotta uninstall OBS and reinstall. I have no idea. Weird. You might need to update EOS <laughs> utility, but. Also, I never record in OBS with my camera. I always record outside of it and then edit it in the program. Like in Premiere, I'll like size it up. Can you say a quote for my school project? Like you want me to just say any quote? Hold on, let me look up good dad Never jokes. back down, never what? All right, here's a good quote. Hold on, hold on. All right. All right, I'm looking for a good quote. Hold on. This is Sparta. To whoever stole my copy of Microsoft Office, I will find you. You have my word. That was terrible. That was really bad. <laughs> that was that was that was so bad. <laughs> Holy shit, that was terrible, bro. <laughs> that shit is garbage. Um, yeah. Oh my How god. How much to say about that one? After this commercial break. <laughs> After this quick commercial break. Fucking five ads, bro. <laughs> Stick the music to it. You ain't no public speaker. That is facts. Tuners, why do you think I'm here? Okay, why do you think I'm here? <laughs> Sometimes, when you're down oh, on yourself, okay. and you need to get back in the game, bust a nut. Bust a nut! All right. See, I could be a public speaker, but it'd have to be in front of people who are either deaf or people who don't care about sensory, because I have no filter. Yeah, straight up. <laughs> All right, guys, we got a very special submission today, okay? This one's coming from our, our one beloved homie, Ice JJ Fish. Um, he dropped an album <laughs> called God's Perfect Timing in 2021, okay? So I don't know if any of y'all have heard this yet. If not, you're going to now. I haven't heard Sit it yet. Sit back and enjoy the ride. Let's just see what this is about. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, it's three and a half minutes. There's something about you, girl. Straight up. Feels like down for you. For you. He laid a sight down for you. For you. He laid a sight down for you. to work bro Get your beat stars today. Huh. Why you ain't buy this beat though? To save us. <laughs> Beatstars.com. Purchase your tracks today. To why, why, why you ain't pay for this beat though? Hey, oh my god, don't the most perfect person to ever touch on this ground. We got yeah, London on the track. Please with everything he did. So he gave Jungle him feet. his crown. He gave him the out of humanity <laughs> that's around the uh, whole. Fuck, dude. All right, that's that. I'm not even gonna get critiques because that's kind of like 
the ideal song right there. <laughs> what do you Just wanna... a cinematic masterpiece. Yeah. <laughs> I don't... Absolute. I would see this in like Interstellar <laughs> when I'm he's so... on the moon. <laughs> I'm so happy I could share this moment with you guys. It's been unreal. Yeah, such a good time and good song. I wish we were back in 2015. Something about you, girl. This one's going diamond. Yeah, Minecraft diamond even. Even better. <laughs> Something about you, girl. All right. I don't know if any of y'all are going to be able to do better than that, but let's see. You know what we should fucking do? We should rank AT, songs run it. with Valorant rankings. <laughs> we should what? <laughs> we should fucking rate songs with Valorant rankings. <laughs> Yeah, this is uh, Silver too. That for song sure. was probably like top 10 Radiant. <laughs> that was top 1 Radiant right there. That's crazy. AT, run it bear. Oh, we're drop top, drop top. Now some I'm stuck in belief Seven chains and I'm watching for leaves Swing glides and I got it on me Drank it lean and I got me a freak Off the purse, she dropped down to her knees Slur, slur, she swallowed me hey, hey, hey. That little bitch, she a bad little hoe Got her a she's still in the show Louis Vuitton, white on the toes Like carry my text, she's shooting these hoes Hopped in the cat, you know she stole Teeth white, but my wrist froze Push your peas, I ain't telling no Move that way through the back door Drop the top, let that gat go Drop the low where they at, though Pussy niggas, they some cat hoes Five by six, let it black blow Put my name on the mat, ho King of my city, no rat, no Pussy niggas with no cash flow Bitch designer with racks in my back Fucking your bitch and I bring her no back She ain't got too mad that I smoking all that Ay, Smoking all that, yeah Never been no rap And I'm with my niggas and we pull up in no way We riding in no bin We don't want no brand We just want that money and we wanna get it up yeah. If it's up, it's stuck yeah. Then it's in my car yeah. Pull up on your bitch and now she turn into my slut yeah. Summer, I'm stuck in belief. Seven chains and a watch for leaves. Twin glides and I got it on me. Drank it lean and I got me a freak. Off the purse, she dropped down to her knees. Slur, slur, she swallowed me. Hey, hey. Bad little bitch, she a bad little hoe. Got her a she's still in the show. Louis Vuitton, white on the toe. Like, carry my text, she's shooting these hoes. Hopped in the cat, you know she stole. Teeth white, but my wrist froze. Push your peas, I ain't telling no. So I'm assuming you're on the hook and then he's here. Rose bushes with no cash flow. And I'm with my niggas and we pull a bit away. We riding in a bin. To be honest, you can tell me this is one person on this whole thing and I'd believe it. It it didn't sound like it changed. Like the the vocal cadence changed a lot, but it sounded like the same voice to me. Um, it was like raspy. Yeah, almost. very raspy the whole time. Um, this was solid. Uh, I thought the mix was pretty good too. I thought it was pretty clean. Uh, the hook is kind of bouncy. At a few points, it felt like the syllable management was a little strange. Like it was like forcing a, sort of a faster flow. Um, but yeah, I mean, this was all right. It's not my favorite, but it's it's pretty solid. Again, a solid song. What do you think? Yeah, like, um, I feel like, are you getting like kind of Polo G ish vibes? Uh, a little, on but the like a for sped sure. up on the production. Yeah. For sure. Um. I feel like if this song came on at a party, like I would be bopping to it. Like I wouldn't be mad if it came on, but I, I don't think I'd go out of my way to listen to it again, you know? Um, so I think it's just finding the balance of making a case for your cadence a little bit like stronger. Cause I feel like it was very m melodic where it could have been more punchy. Um, but yeah, you got a really smooth voice nonetheless. Mm. Yeah. I would actually really like to hear this voice on an R and B song. Like slowed down a little bit. For sure. That song went crazy for me. Which one? Fucking drink sip. Let's go. Hell yeah, bro. You already know. That promo bussy bussin'. You feel me? 
All right. Got you, homie. Thanks for always coming through. I appreciate you, for real. Even if I'm not fucking with every song, I mean, hey, I appreciate you coming through. Appreciate you being here and doing your shit and sharing your art. Stay up. All right, Tricky, bro. Oh, my God, bro. All right. I'm going <laughs> to be straight up, brother. If there's one thing that needs a fix, it's this fucking cover art, dude. What is going on here? Okay. Outlined fucking default goddamn PowerPoint ass font, dude. And you didn't even crop it in. There's fucking a white bar on the right side. Like you screenshotted the shit. <laughs> dude, what are you doing? Damn. Get the cover art fixed up, homie. Fuck. You put a whole project with this shit. What are you Damn. doing? Hey, on the bright side, <laughs> oh he's got the friends will add advisory in the corner. That's facts. He does have that. At least we're warned, you know what I mean? In case we're scared <laughs> swear words like fucking shit. Fuck! <laughs> shit! Just so you know, guys, this song is gonna say fuck in it. So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, goddamn, dude. Fucking Times New Roman handwriting. <laughs> Straight up, what is this shit called? Fucking sidewalk or <laughs> chalkboard or whatever the fuck? Bro, I don't even know what this is. Lobster? There's like a whole lot of shit fucking default fonts. Icky, icky cussing. cussing? What would be like icky cussing? Oh, God. That's ickier than saying fuck. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> saying icky cussing is just, that's, that's <laughs> icky. You know what I mean? Ugh. <laughs> God. I feel like Chip Skylar would say icky cuss words. Chip Scott, wait, hold on. Why don't I know who that is off rip? From Timmy Turner. Yeah, yeah, I figured well, Shiny teeth and me. Yes. <laughs> shiny teeth, shiny teeth. <laughs> Chip Skylar, <laughs> let's go. Oh my god, this guy yeah. is a beauty, dude. Oh, did my camera shut off? Shiny teeth and me. Nope. <laughs> Chip Skylar. <laughs> What a name, dude. Anyway, let's see if the song's bussin' bussin'. You feel me? Let's get this shit run. Um, also, points. Um, I am going to go through like all the submissions from subs first, at the very least, and then we'll run uh, uh, some, some from chat as well. If y'all want to drop like a second one in chat uh, in the Discord as well, feel free. Tricky, you're not guys. alone there, buddy. If I made a cover, it would be dumpy, dumpy on a wall. potential if the mix was there you know say that again i think this could actually have potential if the mix was there 
I agree. I was going to say the mix, it, it feels like it's just... It feels like it's two separate things. Like, mm. it's not... The vocal isn't sitting in the beat. It's just like the beat's out here and the vocal's here. My boy Cheeks. My boy Cheeks. That's good, baby. Welcome in. The fun-loving Cheeks is here. Down the alleyway recommended you, so I pulled up. That's crazy, dude. Can't believe you found down the alleyway without knowing who I was. That's crazy. Um, but yeah, good recommendation on her part for sure. It's a great spot here. Uh, thanks for pulling up. Um, you know what the fuck I got going on. Uh, yeah, bro. I feel like this is two. It feels like two songs playing because there's nothing dynamic left about it. Like it's all just fruity limited. Like it just feels like slam the limiter until it sounds loud enough in my headphones. But that just kills everything. Like everything feels like completely bogged down everything's the same max volume and it just feels like staticky and noisy so leveling of things needs to be working on uh worked on for sure um the vocal mix feels a little bit like i don't know just a simple preset it doesn't feel like it's tailored to your voice it doesn't work perfectly with every tone sometimes you go down like an octave and you're like really chill with your delivery and then other times you're yelling and you're up high and it sounds clearer so it like changes a lot it needs to be more consistent um, the production is really cool though. I like the beat. I think the, the guitars are really cool. It's a cool crossover. It gives me that sort of Lil Uzi vert type vibe. Um, but yeah, man, I think Yeet and Lil Uzi made a song like, yeah, Yeet and Lil Uzi type shit. Like that's actually what this sounds like. So it's a cool cross, man. I, I like the direction and idea, but fuck man. It just feels so <coughs> screwed over in the mix for sure. Um, yeah, I was going to say that at times, like things sound over compressed and then it sounds like there isn't a compressor mm -hmm. you know what i mean like it wasn't consistent in terms of like if you're looking at a cla compressor for example and the needle is consistently hitting like negative five that's what you're looking for you know what i mean but this one feels like it's hitting zero at some points and minus 20 decibels at another point it also feels like the like it's kind of the effect that the like a limiter, like bad limiters will give it. If you don't multiband limit or whatever on your master and you just like peak everything max volume, everything is trying to take up the headroom. And so like when 808s kick in, it lowers what feels like the volume of other sounds in order to take the headroom that it's being squished into. And it's like all of these sounds mesh and merge in the wrong ways. They need to be like all set in stone in their own little area of the EQ. You know what I mean? Um, it's really tough. It takes a long time to like learn mixing and mastering to be like really good at it. But yeah. How do you submit? Uh, first of all, welcome in and do explanation marks, submit in chat, and then you can read the, uh, the response there. And it's what 17 said is true. I didn't mix my own music for a very long time. Yeah, I, I know Zach was doing my shit for the first year while I was learning. So right. I forgot about that fucking stage, dude yeah man That's crazy it was actually at first it was riley you know like rilo mm. he did my very first song and it sounded terrible like listening back to it now obviously but that was like three years ago yeah. four years ago maybe and then i met you and zach and he started doing it and then i was like yeah zach's taking way too long on this shit i'm gonna learn how to do it <laughs> for real yeah it takes it takes time, but you put in a lot of fucking effort on getting like good quality shit off the rip, so like it, it kind of boosted it for you. Yeah, I, I was fortunate enough that I had enough money in the bank to be able to do that. Like, obviously, yeah. some people are less fortunate than that, but. And now that I got that Waves plugin monthly thing, which is fucking goaded. What do you mean? Like twenty five bucks a month, you get every Waves plugin. Who are you? No, this is like a thing. Like this is like a thing that. They oh yeah, 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 yeah. Like that's the thing that you can like get all the plugins from Waves now, which is fucking crazy. But yeah, tricky. Thank you for coming through. As always, I appreciate you. If y'all want to get that, let me know. I'll drop a fucking affiliate link. You can help your boy. I mean, it makes no difference to you. You just click the shit and sign up. But it'll help me because it'll keep me getting my plugins as well. You know what I'm saying? So that's actually a thing. Twenty five bucks a month. All right, all right, all right, all right. Hold on, hold on. Just let me create the affiliate link. Takes me like two seconds. But yeah, this shit's sick, man. They've got like, I think 400 something plugins. Um, it's called Waves Creative Access. And this shit is fucking so nice, man. There's uh, definitely more than 400 because I have, I think I have 400. 
And I haven't bought that. Like, I know I don't have every plugin. I don't know. I think that it says somewhere on their site, I'm pretty sure. Like, literally on this creative access thing, it'll tell you, like, oh, you pay this month much per month, you get all of them. Unless not every plugin is in their thing, but that's how they advertised it. But yeah. Word. Yeah, stock plugins can only get you so far. It's like, it's kind of, the way it kind of works is when you have good knowledge, you can make bad plugins work pretty well for you but it's you'll still hit a ceiling but if you've mm. got good plugins it's easier to have less knowledge because the good plugins do better jobs you know they do a better job um, yeah and the interface of a plugin matters too right like you open up the fruity limiter for example there's so many knobs on that whereas you open l1 and it's two sliders mm -hmm. like i don't know certain plugins interfaces are super simplified yeah um and a lot of plugins that you buy show you a graph as well. Like, for example, Fruity Parametric EQ, you can't compress the frequencies. You can only duck them or boost them. Or whereas Fab Filter or F6 from Waves, you can compress the frequencies. And it's just better. <laughs> For real. Yeah, watch tutorials on whatever ones you need, you know, or whatever ones you want to try out. Just watch the five-minute thing that they have on their uh, website about it. You'll fucking understand. It's pretty fucking simple, actually. It'll help a lot. Yeah. Um, I'm just, I'm just gonna type some plugins that I would recommend in the chat. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I could do the same as well because I got some fucking crazy mastering plugins. But yeah, if you click that link and then like just check out with whatever, um, that'll help support your boy. I would appreciate it. Um, but yeah, stay up, gang. All right, we got Drink Sip from Adel Tuners, ATL, my boy. And then uh, Points GG, you in here still, bro? Feel free to drop your shit. I'll throw you in the queue as well. All right. This a hit, Codex. Make sure it's uh, YouTube, oh, SoundCloud, or Spotify. <laughs> Young yeah, Lottie, hey, you the shooter, right? I'ma lay him in a ditch. Real right blood, I ain't sharing with a bitch. If we got smoke, I'ma roll you in a Swiss. Niggas know we active for the shoot, I don't miss. All my brothers stepping, we be stepping out with sticks. If I see an R, I'ma spark him with a big. Throw the fucking set, we be riding through the six. I done caught a body, sometimes I reminisce. Life too hard, you can hey, see it in Toronto? my face. Drinking all the slicker, got me feeling like a prince. Fucking all these bitches, got me this feeling Toronto? like a pimp. He just said this dick. Give me what I miss. I've been feeling lonely when I'm moving I all these bricks. No love in the game, fell in love with risk. I swear he said rolling through the six. I could be sure. That wouldn't make sense. Neck. She thought it was a gift. Call my ass a genie because I grinded her a wish. Once I hit twice, I ain't hit it in again. Throw it to the bros, then we call her shit a sin. We've been fucking bitches in the back of a bins. I've been living life, I splurge, I spin. Drink, sip, all I see is drip. Racks in my pocket, I just spent it at the fifth. Dude, the pocket, fit is so hard. Brand new whip costs more than your crib. Drink, sip, all I see is drip. Ice on my neck costs more than your rent. Out late night with a fire and a switch. Lay his ass down, then we threw him in a trench. Push the hell away, I ain't never touch a bitch. Die, 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 I don't think he's gonna live. Lie, 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 I ain't never trust a bitch. Growing up thugging, I was dealing as a kid. My pot's not here, so I bought my ass a blick. Streets say say, so I hope I get rich. I was 13 when I hit my first lick. I was 15 when I hit my first bitch. Fucked out the park, cause I'm barely at the crib. Dropped her knees and she's swallowing my kids. We've been fucking bitches in the back of a bins. I've been living life, I splurge, I spin. Drink, sip, all you see is drip. Racks in my pocket, I just spent it at the fifth. Hundreds in my pocket, I just bought a new fit. Brand new whip costs more than your crib. Drink, sip, all you see is drip. Ice on my neck costs more than your rent. Ice on my neck costs more than your rent. This ice on my neck costs more than your rent. Fucking little Tay type shit. Um, but yeah, I I've already heard so. this. What did you think, bro? Uh, I haven't heard this, but this music video is fucking crazy. Like, it's it's pretty simple shots, but the quality of it is nice. You know? I agree. It is a nice vid, and bro's got a crazy fit from one of his homies. Like that's so sick, man. I want a boy that's like in fashion, that's like actually close as well. Cause 
my boy Lunar, he does like jewelry and like he makes rugs and shit. I got a custom rug and my logo and then like some cool jewelry. Um, I gotta show y'all. I can show you this fucking in a sec, but um, yeah, he's so gonna sick. have to vacuum it and steam clean it before he shows you. No, I'm not gonna show the rug. I've already shown the rug. Bro had a bunch of companies fucking copy and mass produce his shit on like a garbage scale. But he made like a mystery box ring from like fucking COD, COD Zombies. Mm -hmm. um, and he made like a whole mystery box case for it and everything. And then like, whatever, this shit's uh, in my ring size. And then like this actually fucking, let's see if it'll focus. This shit actually pops up. It's got the ray gun. Like, bro, how fucking sick is that shit? Pew, pew, pew. It's so hard. <laughs> but yeah. Damn, so you're making. Boy. Bro, why is your hand twitching? I'm trying to focus it up, boy. All right, put it back in here. But yeah, shit's fucking hard. Um... <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, Sky Too Tuffy. Let's hear it, my boy. Made it on Band Lab. Is your first song? Okay. All right. Let's go easy. Unless this bro's super talented. But let's let's go easy. First song. Uh, not everybody's me, man. <laughs> I just kidding. Never back down, never what? <laughs> I don't know yeah. why. Every time I hear it, I'm just like, I love it. I agree. It's like club. I'm fucking this bitch and I'm fucking her friend. She wanna hop in cause I ride in a Benz. Me and my twin, we fucking the tens. I'm just trying to fuck, yeah, we're not friends. Damn. Yeah, yeah. We are not making this music, I don't got no choice. Shady wanna fuck what she hear in my voice. Texting my phone, now I'm getting annoyed. These niggas be talking, these niggas be fuck. These niggas be talking, these niggas be switching. They getting real different, they be. I pull up with shooters, I pull up with chops, so a nigga better not be messing with me. Is that it? No, 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 sorry. It's just like, you better not be messing with me. It sounded so. <laughs> niggas be switching, they getting real different, they be. I pull up with shooters, I pull up with chops, so a nigga better not be messing with me. Switching, they all on my meat. I was you hated, you asked for a fee. I'm stacking this bread, I ain't talking about weed. Damn, these niggas be mad that I'm rapping on beats. Money so bad, bitch, I'm feeling like. Oh, the bell! Bad bitch, they follow the way. Bad niggas now get paid. Bad bitch, on my phone, wanna suck it away. Bad bitch, she follow the sequence. Like, damn, bitch, you was a demon. Damn, bitch, you was a demon. All the way over the top, yo. The nigga drift you for the guy, yo. Make one cut and we finna slap with a bro. These bullets gon' spread like a watery house. These niggas talk shit with a tag on your toe. Is this you yeah, at the end of the show? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, it sounded like it switched. I was like, it sounds like. Oh, person. okay, it is a new person. Um, yeah, the person at the end sounded like if had a cleaner like delivery, like sounded just more like I don't know, just it felt more natural. Could be the key as well. But um, the biggest thing that I would say is a lot of it was like. You know, trying to go in key and be melodic, but the auto tune wasn't dragging it to the right notes, so it could have been set in a close but the wrong key, or it's just like it's not harsh enough and you're not hitting the keys close enough, so it's just fucking putting them in the wrong spots. I don't know what was going on there, but it definitely sounded off key in a lot of points. Vocals are very high end heavy. Um, there's like a lot of like high frequencies that are pretty piercing on the ears, but like I mean, as you record and get better and like upgrade your equipment and stuff, it'll sound better. Um, but yeah, man, I don't know much about band lab, so I can't really say shit, right? Like, I know a lot of people be making cool shit on there. I know a lot of people be pretending like they make cool shit on there by just exporting their stems from fucking, you know, FL or whatever. Uh, but it is tough when you're doing shit in band lab, you know what I mean? Because you're only limited to whatever they give you versus, like, extra shit. Um, yeah, so. it's very, like... I, it seems like everybody goes to band lab to start. I feel like... Um, before you like start, you should just search up like top five DAWs or whatever. 
whatever the search would be, you know, um, a lot of people would get geared towards Pro Tools probably, but I don't know. I like FL personally. I have Pro Tools as well. Not a huge fan. I think it's yeah. just because I'm so used to FL. But Band Lab, like you said, it's limited. Um, this vocal felt very dry, like not a lot of effects, no flanger, no chorus and stuff like that. It was pretty much just your raw voice with a little bit of delay and auto tune. Um, but I can hear the potential. I can hear the potential, yeah. especially for your first song. I agree. It, it's kind of tough too when you like go from just starting to like hopping into making, uh, you know, trying to spit shit about being tough when you don't sound tough. You know what I mean? Like I don't feel like I believe you. You know what I mean? Like I may not be a fucking tough guy, but like I'm comfortable on the mic that I could fucking come out with some like hard delivery that makes you believe that I believe what I'm saying. You know what I mean? So like mm -hmm. I feel like you really need to constantly just make more and more music. For being your first song, it's solid. You're ahead of a lot of people, especially me from when I started. You know what I mean? Like, I've shown my first song on this stream a billion fucking times, and the shit is fucking ass. You know what I mean? I, you know what I mixed the song in? Fucking Ado uh, Adobe After Effects, bro. I recorded those into fucking... Uh, what, what's that shitty free program in Microsoft? What's I don't called? know. I used Audacity uh, for a long time. Yes, Audacity. Yeah, yeah. So I recorded in Audacity, brought it into fucking After Effects, and then edited it on a video timeline and fucking put reverb on it and then exported it and then reconverted it to an MP4. Or an MP3, sorry. And then uploaded that shit. Like, that was fucking so dumb. So, I mean, hey, man. Yeah. You can start making good shit at any point, you know what I mean? So keep working forward, bro. Um, yeah. I hear the potential. Just ain't there yet. One producer told me you got to become an actor when you're recording. Make people believe what you say. Yeah, exactly. For real. Like, it all depends, too. Because, like, if it's a real emotion, you shouldn't have to act, right? Like, you shouldn't. Like, you should be able to normally f just feel that. But if you want to hit a certain mood, then, yeah, it's like kind of becoming an actor. You know, you're all, you're faking sort of the vibe that you're going for. Because it may not be true to your regular character. But doesn't mean that it's not your own art. It's not your own vision. Being an act uh, actor is like being an artist, so. I just sent in my first song. Oh, God, Capes. <laughs> ah, damn. Let's hear this shit, bro. Have I heard this? <laughs> I don't know. All right. I don't know. It's unlisted on YouTube. Okay, I got a couple to open first. I got <laughs> Tricky, then Lamb, and then Capes. Possible song. <laughs> this, it, it possibly could be a song. I don't know. Uh, this is just for reference, by the way, guys. This is just for reference. If any of you are new to music, this was my first song. All right, tricky. <laughs> Let's hear another one for this. I be feeling faded even when I don't smoke now. All this smoke got to my head, get left on red, that's what I'm about. Cause I really, really don't like it when that bitch run her mouth. And I really, really don't like it when she see my account. So I had to let her go m m Money on my mind, I make money on my phone And the time I feel alive is when I'm driving on the road And the time of my life, I ain't have yet one of those And I really, really feel like you should know I really feel better than I ever have been before I got a point there yeah. person I mix for now. Okay, I'm gonna pause it there. 
again another one that feels pretty slammed for sure on the final master um i think your flow is actually pretty solid on here and i think one thing that you do really well is like those yeet type things that are like the backup pitched vocals that are like high squealy like atmospheric mm -hmm. layers like i feel like those are really good they may be a little bit loud in my opinion most of the time but they are really good i think they sound super clean it's like a great sort of rendition of them i think they sound really good um the thing that's not working here for me mostly is the kick and eight away pattern they don't feel like they fit the bounce at all this feels like they're just a 808 and kick pattern that just is in key and that's it it doesn't feel like it's following the melodies or the flow of your vocals or anything they just feel like they're on there so um yeah i feel like that needed a better bounce for this tempo and you know just the feel of the song um but yeah what'd you think case hi mofo thank you for dropping in um to be honest i'm a really big fan of your flows like i think this is the second or third song this stream that i've heard from you and your flows are very consistent and in the pocket of the beat that you're on. You know, like none of them sound the same, even though they're on. I'm not going to call everyone a yeet type beat, but it is in that category. Um, but they're all different. So I uh, I really like that um, part of it. Yeah. And I like your voice. I uh, it's one of those voices that I want to mix myself, you know. You make all your beats. Have you, is every song that you have out something that you've made the beat for? Do you make your melodies too? I don't make my melodies, dog. <laughs> melodies are tough to make, bro. They tough. You know what I should do? I should just start making guitar loops and then sending them to you and you put drums on them and then we make a fucking song. Fuck it, we ball. <laughs> you make everything yeah that's that's sick man that's sick a lot of the beats that i end up making for myself i end up using samples but um yeah man it's tough for me to make melodies i feel like melodies are the hardest part i can always make cool melodies for like beats that like don't work for my voice but i can never combine them both it's really hard Once i feel you i've been making boom bap type beats and i know i'm not hopping on that <laughs> Do you think about me when you're holding someone else? Cause I think of you all the time I know you're not good for my health And it's better that you love But I'm not good at saying goodbyes I know that I'll let go for all the right reasons We yeah, were yeah, getting yeah. close to the edge I'm always set on like making Say something that's actually gonna go out that's the thing true oh God, sometimes we like felt too hard
saying, bro? Or also, what'd you say first? Say that again. Oh, I said, did you buy covers for your headphones? Yeah, mine were like shredding. Like they started ripping, so I had to buy new ones, like new cuffs. Oh, got you. Mm-hmm. Um. Anyways, I wish in the hook that the um, falsetto vocals were a little bit louder. Um, they were very faint. Like you could hear them, but like they could be more up front. Um, I feel like the vocal could also be more atmospheric. It's like very mono sounding. And like seventeen said, it's to the right, ever so slightly, but it's noticeable. Yeah, I don't, th- I don't think his were on the right. I think the feature. Though. No, no, no. The the yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, the feature sounded like his vocals are slightly on the right. Um, and yeah, I saw that it was a demo, so I figured it was just like kind of a rough draft of the thing. But yeah, it does feel a little dry to me. Like it doesn't feel like it has any reverb or delay, so it's not spacious. It doesn't feel like it's full and distant. Um, so I feel like it needs some of that for sure. And one that thing. Means- Sorry. Yeah, go ahead. Go, go ahead. ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Um, that being said, like, critique aside, I love the vibe of the song. Mm. Like, that's not to be said for the mix, um, but the overall, like, performance is there. And I feel like the vibe is very car ride-esque. Yeah. <laughs> like, like, I'm driving down a country road and just kind of vibing to the song. Agreed. This man dropped a song. I forget what it's called, but it was like really good. It sound honestly, it sounded like a radio hit, like a fucking phenomenal track. And I forget what it's called, but it's out now. Um, and I feel like you'd really, really fuck with it. I think it's pretty damn near a perfect track for something like uh, Into the Spideyverse or whatever. Into the Spiderverse. Oh, um, okay, okay. I feel like it fits that kind of vibe a lot. And I mean, he's even got the same sort of art style going on on the fucking cover. So, yeah, man, I fuck with the vibe. Um, I do think your vocals need to be more wet and full. Obviously fix that slightly to the right thing on the the feature. And one thing that was kind of bothering me the most about the song is that the hook didn't feel like it had that build up feeling. Like there was no like drums that go like, you know what I mean? Or like any sort of thing to like kind of bring us to the drop where I feel like it needed something in the percussion to make it feel like, oh, the hook is about to be here, and this is, like, the most exciting part of the song. It just kind of started happening, um, which felt weird to me. Um, younger, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's the song. That shit's hard. I'm going to listen to it after stream. Mm-hmm. He said he sent it to you before uh, to review the mix, so you probably heard it. But Yeah, I don't remember. I haven't streamed in so long, dude. I stream like once a year. <laughs> but yeah, man, besides that, I fuck with this. I fuck with this a lot. I think this is solid. And I think it's a good direction for you. Um, yeah, man. Good shit. Thank you for the submission and the resub. And now we get to listen to Caves. First song ever. Possible song. I'm not even going to I'm not even gonna fucking pull this up on screen. Let's just fucking listen. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember that song as soon as I played it. What's well, good? My feelings have been gone Bitch, you're in the wrong I don't wanna live life with you anymore Yeah I go home In an old Yeah I wanna go alone without you seeing in my review Wasting all my time I've been That reverb goes right. crazy Don't wish <laughs> it, I really don't need it the left ear <laughs> oh my god why is it on the left god, i didn't know what i was doing how did this even happen james <laughs> it just ends <laughs> hold on <laughs> it just ends it's like one minute perfectly like bro had just enough free trial time to export it that's crazy bro <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> uh, it literally ends perfectly at one minute, bro. Was this a free trial of like fucking FL or something? Like what? Were Dude, you I don't. I don't remember if it was Audacity or what the fuck it was. 
Like, do you remember the Audacity auto tune called G Snap? I'm pretty sure that's what it was. Jeez. <laughs> no, I've never heard of that, but that sounds hilarious. <laughs> it's like, it bro, was... <laughs> there was a point where I used to use the fucking, uh, what is it called in FL? Is it just tuner? or A uh, pitcher. Pitcher. Bro, that shit's so ass. Yeah, dude. I used to use fucking Audacity for everything. I used to do, like, fuck, I don't know, 2015? Uh, that's when I like started getting into recording covers and shit. I would use Audacity, and it wasn't even called Reverb; it was called Echo. <laughs> I would just stick that on my wow. dry vocal, no auto tune. Before I found out what G Snap was, dude. I remember when I used to <laughs> fucking record in uh, uh, Audacity with fucking the boys. We would record on a fucking uh, a Zoom mic. Do you know what a Zoom mic is? No. It's a fucking um a two input mic for film. So basically you're supposed to use it for like making movies and like capturing like audio from left and right. You know what I mean? <laughs> so we would have that on the desk with a sock on it and make sure that we were lined up perfectly in the middle to get us a, <laughs> a fucking mono type recording, very centered. And we yeah. would wrap into that, take the SD card out, put it in the computer, Put it in the fucking audacity and then throw on echo and fucking reverb, dude. That was the whole formula. <laughs> and then to show it to your friends, you'd have to fucking burn it on a CD. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, it wasn't that crazy. It wasn't that crazy. But what we did do is all of them had iPhones and I was the only one with an Android. And I, at that time, there was no like... It was like the beginning of the era where you couldn't open MP3s. Yeah. Like you couldn't yeah. do it. Which, by the way, there's a way to do it in Spotify. You can open local files. I do that. Anyway, the, uh, yeah, I like would pull it up on my fucking MP3 player app that comes stuck <laughs> with the Android and like play the shit in a car with a fucking, uh, Bluetooth receiver, bro. Dude, you know what I used to do? So my dad, my dad used to have an O2 Dodge Dakota black truck. Yeah. And it had no aux cord. So I had a cassette tape with an aux cord connected to it. And I stuck it in to the cassette player in the truck. Oh, my God. And the aux cord would plug into my fucking Samsung Galaxy S2. And that's how I would play my music. Bro, that's crazy. We both have the Galaxy S2. That's so sick. Yeah. Man. Dude, I went from the Galaxy S2... And then my mom gave me her S3, and then I finally got, like, an S5. And then I switched to iPhone after that. Dude, I remember the fucking S3. I think it was the S3 that came out, and it was, like, the first, like, waterproof track. Or, uh, waterproof track. Waterproof phone. Or, like, oh, it was bro. water resistant. It was, like, don't drop it in water, but, like, you can, like, get it wet, kind of. Yeah, yeah. And I was, like, yo, I need to get that. And my dad's, like, bro, you don't need this fucking shit. Like, if you're gonna get it wet it's gonna get fucking soaked you know what i mean <laughs> yeah. and i was like but dad it's waterproof like i could do waterproof things he's <laughs> <laughs> like shut the fuck up you're getting the non-waterproof version i'm like okay fine i think it was yeah. the s3 it was one of the galaxies but anyway dude do you remember nokia phones where you had to press the button three times for a fucking letter that you wanted yes dude my mom used to give me her old flip phones when she was done with them and i was like yo this is sick it's got tetris on it i used yeah, to literally. love getting her old flip phones fucking brick breaker yeah this one girl that i had a crush on too and on my bus i remember she fucking used to have a slide phone and i was like oh my god you're the perfect person i was like bro the slide phone that you would turn sideways and it would be a full keyboard that shit was fucking amazing dude i love those days <laughs> dude in order Much my phone tricky. went fucking i had a nokia brick phone and then i upgraded to a uh blackberry curve i think <laughs> um nice, bro. and then that's when the samsung galaxy came out after that but dude right. blackberry was the shit for a while like bbm you ever have bbm blackberry messenger no i never had a blackberry i knew a lot of people that did but it was mostly dads oh so my dad actually had a plan through uh his work at the time yep i did too and i got his old phone which was the blackberry curve and he got the fucking iphone 5c i think yeah um anyways the blackberry you could like it was when uh scantrons first came out and you could scan their barcode 
and get their BBM, and it was kind of like Facebook Messenger, but for BlackBerry. Wow, dude. <laughs> Throwback days. That's crazy. <laughs> All right, gang. Hey, I'm hopping off for the day. We were just fucking chatting about some weird retro shit, but I appreciate you coming through. Thank you to everyone who's been here for all the double submissions and newbies that's come through. I appreciate y'all. I do these streams every Friday. I know it's Saturday, but normally I do them on Friday, 1 p.m. PST. So set a reminder on your phone, 1 p.m. PST. Uh, I just couldn't do it yesterday because there's been construction going on at my house. So anyway, thank you, Caves, for coming on. I appreciate you, brother. Um, yeah. Appreciate you having me on, brother. Yes, sir. Deuces. Later, later.